On the Group tabs, you can manage the groups on your team's account. This tab allows you to group users and resources that at the same time can be organized in a hierarchy. The resources that can be assigned to each group are folders and printers. To create a group, click on the Create Group button. On the pop-up menu, you can name this group, add a description, and choose which group or groups it belongs to. You can switch to the tree view to see the hierarchy between groups. Groups have access to all the resources in their subgroups. On the Roles tab, you can manage the roles for your team's account. Roles are assigned to a user in a specific group. The same user can have different roles in different groups. The role indicates the permissions that each user has to access, manage, or see the resources associated with the group. To create a role, click on the Create Role button, name it, and check the permissions necessary for this role. The permissions are categorized into Plan permissions about the team's account and its management Groups permissions that allow user and resource management 3D printer permissions that allow you to see printers and manage their queues Folder permissions that also include file permissions Workflow permissions that specialize the users assigned to a workflow And cluster permissions that allow you to group the printers you can click on All to add permissions for an entire category or check individual ones. When you are done adding permissions, click on Save and this role will be ready to be assigned to users.